Hey guys, Denise Salcedo here for Red Carpet Report, and tonight we're backstage at The Voice talking to the top 12 contestants. So Team Adam, guys, first of all, congratulations on making it onto the top 12. And also, I do want to mention that I did notice you guys had the skinny jean. Was there like a memo that went around? I think it's just a general memo of the 2016 the, season. That's just the look. I don't know. They tell me to wear it, I put it on. You're like, whatever like, it takes, yeah, right? Yeah, whatever. That's so funny. Awesome. So, you know, how do you guys feel, you know, now that you guys had your first live playoff performance? Was it what you guys hoped it would be? Did you guys, were you guys happy with your performances? What were your thoughts? I'm just super grateful that America has voted me this far. Um, that was always just my biggest fear. And hopefully I can convey an honesty and a truth that is so in me. Uh, and that's tough, you know, to, to sing a, a song that will make people want to vote, you know? It, are you singing the right thing? Are you picking the right lyric content? Um, so yeah, I'm just, I'm super grateful for, for the moment, <laughs> yeah. What about you, Brandon? Yeah, just, um, I mean, getting to this point is, is something I never would have, in my wildest imagination, predicted. Um, I've, been, you know, I've been playing music in, in bars and stuff and open mics for, you know, 20 people, 15 of which didn't even know there was music that night. So it's like, it's insane. It, I feel like I'm every, any moment I'm gonna wake up from, from a dream, so. That's Same. awesome. So, you know, even though you guys have both diff different backgrounds, you know, you have your backgrounds in music, both respectfully. Billy, do you feel like there's any additional pressure for you considering that you were a child star? Um, no, it would have been a pressure if I was doing the same thing, I think. Um, but at 11 years old, I grew up on country music, but you're being told what to, who, who, who are you at 11, you know? I was super happy that I had that honor and that time, but you know, 17 years later now, uh, I'm totally in a moment where I should have been then. And I'm so happy that I get that second chance because it's, yeah, it's what it is, you know? And I'm just happy that America is proud of me. Yeah, and Ali San did it last, you know, last season. So, you know, you never know with all of that. Um, Brandon, I have to ask you, last week was crazy for you. You yeah. know, you were saved by Adam yeah. and yes. you had some tough people right next to you yeah. that were right up there. Were you shocked? Did you expect it? How did you feel? I was, I mean, it was, uh, yeah, I was, I was a little, I was stressed out. That would be the first, uh, first answer. I, I was not, I didn't know what to expect. I mean, the credits were literally rolling. Adam was like, all right guys, shut up. Like, I gotta make a decision. And I'm like, I'm just like, he could say anything. And then it was said my name. I was like, did he pronounce Riley's name wrong? Or, he, oh, me? All right, cool. I don't know. I'm just, I'm just so happy. I'm just, you know, like every step of this is like playing with house money. It's awesome. Last question. You guys have been working with Adam, obviously. He has been, you know, the longtime running coach. What is the best advice or tip that he has given you guys so far in the competition? Billy? <laughs> the, the one thing that really set me back a few paces and I had to do a lot of homework was pocket singing in the pocket and, and, and not letting singing override the lyrics. Um, that, was, that was some great advice and it's something I didn't think about and to put that in my front lobe, if you will, and really start to hone in on that one aspect was invaluable to me. And I've noticed a difference just in myself. Yeah. He told me um, to smile more, and whenever you need to smile, just think of something dirty. Oh, that's, so, a, that's yeah, great advice. Yeah. I think that's great advice for pretty much any aspect yeah. of your life, whether totally. or not you're on the voice stage. Totally. A presentation, a <laughs> uh, book report, yeah. You know, anyway. Awesome. Well, thank you guys so much. Thank Team so Adam, much. congratulations. And I seriously hope to see you guys both next week on the Top 11. Okay? So. Keep having fun. Keep seeing those performances. Thank you guys thank so you, much. So much. Take care. Thank you. Thank, thank, you. You. thank you. Thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure to give me a thumbs up if you like this video. Subscribe to our YouTube channel for more. And in the comments below, let me know who is your favorite in the top 12.